Hello there, it's uh, coming on middle of March 2019 and a bit of an update on where I am with the cars and my projects and uh, everything. I've been asked a lot about this car. I don't show it very much because it's a Cadillac channel, not a Ford channel, but it was restored by me several years ago and uh, it was completely burned out and I put in a brand new dash and and uh, rewired the whole car. Um, this dash is out of a 91 Crown Vic. If you watch my uh, s uh, channel, go farther back, about 2012, 2013, you can see the restoration of this car. My dad bought a brand new 29 years ago and it burned out. And long story short, the insurance company refused to help me. And uh, so I said, I'll do it myself, and I did. I rewired the car, put a new dash in it, new floors, new body mounts, and uh, back on the road and fully certified. So uh, don't ever say no to me, I guess, because I can make make sure that you're wrong. So uh, happy that I proved them wrong, that the car was restorable and was put back on the road. And I keep it nice f for my father's memory, not to, uh, just, just don't drive it very much. You know, it's a nice car. I love it, but uh, I'm not a big Ford guy, but it's my dad's car, so... I keep her nice for him. Either way, um, this is the uh, Crown Vic. Another question was about this engine. I bought it um, last summer, and then I, right after I bought it, I bought the 60 Bel Air, and that took all my time. And I hope you guys can see this. Uh, you probably can't. Maybe you can. I'm trying to go a bit closer. There. Six. Three. I had a character. I call him a character guy being polite. Uh, said that's a 429. No, no, no. A real be ignorant character. And on YouTube. And I said to him, okay, Pally. I'll show you who's right. So I scraped this off. And it's a 63. That's not a 6. That's a 3. 63. 390. It's the only engine they had in uh, in '63 was a 390, and um, I ran the number through the Cadillac uh, website, and I got out the figures. It would have came out new in a '63 Coupe de Ville. So there you go. So uh, I call these people, you know, keyboard warriors. They uh, act all strong and mighty and belligerent behind a screen, but face to face, they fall like a wet Kleenex. So, uh, I was correct. I know what I'm talking about. It's a 390. I bought it for a spare for my other Cadillac. I always buy Cadillacs, and uh, not all of them have good engines. So, this is a good, solid core. A running engine. I'm going to still continue to restore it and give it what it needs, but the Bel Air has been my priority, and right now it's being stripped down for the paint pulling bumpers and chrome and all that stuff but uh, I should have that car back from where it is in a week or so and I'll show you where I am with it now and it's supposed to be in the paint shop late next month and then I'll put in the new interior and all that fun stuff but uh, I'm so glad you guys like the channel and thank you for all the questions and wondering where, where, where we are with projects I also have some really exciting news coming up this spring I got the Bel Air coming out to be completed but also I got and other car coming in, a car I've been chasing for over 20 years, I finally got it, and it's a huge story, a huge deal, and I think you're going to like it. It's a bit of a teaser, but wait and see, and uh, you'll love this car, because I've been looking at this car for a long, long time, and I finally was able to arrange a deal to bring her home. So, once the snow's gone, it's snowing right now, I'll bring her back and I'll show it to you, and it's a real sweetheart. It's a keeper car too. So thank you for watching and have a great day.